get some uh, of this nice curry puff I usually buy for my wife for picking up my son yeah super tired today maybe it's uh, it's from the weekend you know I stayed up late had a nice uh, long walk around the estate where uh, my son has his epic Still no closer to getting the uh, weighing machine that I wanted so like there's none on carousel and stuff so if I want to get a new one I gotta wait till my salary again if anyone you know and if you guys watching this you have and you don't have a need for it let me know be so soon because you know there's still people like uh, wanting to treat me for lunch and all that so that's gonna screw things up a lot all in all today was good um, I bring my students to to a nearby primary school um, of course I couldn't get I couldn't film the actual thing because of uh, privacy issues and all that it, it was a good experience I mean the kids there they get to interact with kids with autism uh, that I'm teaching it gives me hope that maybe in the future uh, society here can be more inclusive than they already are you know seeing those students uh, interact with my students you know gives me gives me hope gives me hope and and it's not just because my son has autism uh, I've been working with people with autism since like a decade and a half I think yeah so it's always difficult to to get people to understand so that we can be a more inclusive society but what I saw today it gave me hope. It really does. You know? If these students were to grow up and continue with being inclusive, continue being uh, how they were today, uh, our society, I don't, I don't think our society is a lost cause. In comparison to that, you know, me, like losing weight, me, like uh, quitting smoking pales a lot, all right, to, to that future that I, I see. So yeah, I can't, I can't get my weighing machine, I can't get my second phase of what I want to do started, but, you know, seeing that today, what a possible future inclusive society would be, 
um, that's good enough for me today. And I'll leave you guys with that as I wait for my son to finish this epic. Well, I wanted to leave you guys with that, but um, my son's epic center just called and he like, he vomited. So, and uh, you know, there's no extra pair of shorts because they already changed it during his childcare. So I'm now off to get some shorts for him somewhere. I hope I can find some. Santa told me that it's somewhere there. Shop that sells uh, children's uh, clothes. We'll see, find out. I think this is it. Yeah. Managed to get it. So let's see if I uh, oh, can make it in time to change him. Walking, okay? Yeah, we're gonna take two to five W. Are you okay? No. Huh? You're not okay? You're not. Are you sick? No. And you're not sick. The bus now, eh? he seems fine. Yeah. So, yeah, things like this pop up sometimes. My son ran a fever shortly after after dinner, so uh, gave him his meds. Um, sleeping now. I hope he's better. Hopefully he is, because it's a short day tomorrow for him, and it's, uh, my parents will pick him up afterwards. I really hope he gets better by tomorrow. Yeah. Anyway, peace out guys.